In a statement, the UN Assistance Mission in Afghanistan, UNAMA, also urged the de facto authorities to reopen girls' schools beyond the sixth grade and end all measures preventing women and girls from participating fully in daily public life. UN Human Rights High Commissioner Volker Turk described the ban as another appalling and cruel blow to the rights of Afghan women and girls and a deeply regrettable setback for the entire country. Reminding that their systematic exclusion from virtually all aspects of life is unparalleled in the world. He upheld that banning women from tertiary education is all the more heartbreaking when considering their vital contributions over the years. Coming on top of girls being barred from attending secondary school, just think of all the female doctors, lawyers and teachers who have been, and who will be, lost to the development of the country, said the senior UN official. He stated that suspending women from tertiary and higher education is in clear violation of Afghanistan's obligations under international law. Adding that their rights to access all levels of education without discrimination is fundamental and unquestionable. Banning women from attending university is a continuation of the Taliban's systematic discrimination policies. Since August 2021, they have barred girls from secondary school. Restricted women and girls' freedom of movement, excluded women from most of the workforce and banned them from using parks, gyms and public bathhouses.